Good morning, happy first day of school. Today is Thursday and today is the first day and then we have tomorrow which is Friday off and then Monday off as well for Labor Day weekend. So we don't go back for a second day until Tuesday next week. So today's gonna be a good first day. I'm excited to start fresh in third grade if you are new, definitely hit the subscribe button to keep up to date with all my teaching and lifestyle related videos. I'm a fourth year teacher teaching third grade again this year. I taught fifth grade for two years and then I started in third grade last year, seven weeks into the school year. If you haven't already seen my classroom setup vlogs from this school year, I will have those linked down below as well as the open house vlog where I'm like just preparing for open house and doing last minute classroom things. I'm excited but I'm also like not ready like I feel like my body's still in denial. This happened last year too. Like it just doesn't feel like the first day of school. I'm not like nervous yet but I'm sure that will happen soon. I will show you guys my outfit and stuff when I get into my classroom. It is 6.48. I'm gonna head into work a little bit early today. Hopefully get there about an hour early just to feel prepared for the day. I already stood late yesterday preparing everything so I'm really all set but I like to get there early and also my team and I want to film that like viral TikTok where it's like my name is Miss Tamela and this is me before the first day of school and then you do after the first day of school so I think that'll be really fun. I am literally gonna bring this box fan with me to work because it is so hot in my classroom. We don't have AC. It's a really old building so I'm going to take this to hopefully alleviate some of the heat. We are now in my classroom. It is 7.32. We don't have to be here until 8. And I usually get here early anyway, especially for the first day of school. Yesterday I set up everything I need. So this is like all the stuff for before lunch. This is after lunch. These are my first day plans. I'm going to turn on all my little lights. Oh no, one of them fell. No, I'm gonna put some more command strips on that. Grab my little handy dandy remote outlets. I have these linked to my Amazon storefront. Um, and then these fake candles are from Lamp Lust. And you can do like the flicker or you can keep it steady. So it's really cute. My handy dandy PowerPoint clicker. And then from the brand Afmat, this is actually sponsored, but they sent me this as well as some other goodies from my classroom, like a pencil sharpener. It's still in my car, I have to go grab it. And then I have a colored pencil sharpener on the way too. But this is an electric stapler and I'm so excited about it because once we start getting into like our math center workbooks and reading center workbooks, I always have to staple a bunch of packets. So this will be nice. strips hopefully it stays up um or at least for the day if i come back on like on tuesday and it's fallen like whatever i'll have to just get like better command strips because these are like off brand i'm just hoping they don't fall during the school day um but it was nice that it like when it fell it fell on the map and not like the floor to shatter or hit someone so that's good for my outfit i got this dress literally yesterday at tj maxx no marshall's and then i just curled my hair um, put it like half up half down. These earrings might be from Primark. I don't know um, but Yeah, I think the dress is really cute. It has like these cute little roughly sleeves and then my shoes are from Amazon they're just like these little platform sandals that I also wore for open house on Tuesday. That's my outfit <laughs> like 750 something so we are about to get started with the day i'll try to update you guys during my lunch and if not just at the end of the school day so it is now my lunch break the lighting is not good because it's backlit everything's going pretty well i'm excited i have 19 kids we practice like our morning meeting which includes like our voice levels our whole group expectations all that stuff we did a getting to know miss Mello game which was fun they did a find someone who classmate activity they did a reading inventory we did a brain break we i actually remembered to do a brain break so now it's lunch our lunch this year and recess is from 11 30 to 12 30 so that's my lunch slash prep so i'm on lunch right now i brought 
some miscellaneous stuff to snack on basically, but veggie platter and then some watermelon. And then I just have my strawberries and cream Dr. Pep. I've gotten to see so many of my students from last year. It's so sweet seeing them because I think I mentioned this in a video, but like I obviously taught fifth grade for two years. So once they left me, I like never saw them again unless they visited because like luckily the school was, the middle school was nearby. But at my new school, I'm obviously teaching third grade and the highest grade here is fourth grade. So I get to see them for a year after, which is just so sweet. I've had a lot of visits. So yeah, we fit in all of this. I was really happy that we stood on schedule and then after lunch is just math and the end of the day, basically. This is the stuff that we have left for the day. We did everything else. This is just math stuff. We are done with the first day. It went really well. I honestly have no complaints. Um, went really smoothly and I'm excited to get to know all my kids more. I. I'm honestly gonna go home, but I did make some copies for the end of next week. I basically have all of next week already planned and all the stuff printed that I need, but I needed to print our reading center workbooks and our math center workbooks. Um, so I just made copies and I have it now. And I wanna try my electric stapler from AFMAT. This is sponsored by them, but I'm so excited to try this electric stapler because the amount of packets I stapled last year this is gonna save me so much time and it's gonna be so much easier and my poor hands won't have carpal tunnel which they already do it's just gonna be a lot easier so I'm really excited so I'm gonna try it out with you guys and let you know what I think okay, so this is what I have for our reading center workbook for the end of next week we're gonna do it together so it's a little bit longer um, and we're gonna continue it throughout the next week as well this is a first page senses of school we have what if there were no rules, which is great because we will just be wrapping up our three class rules. A writing prompt about third grade. Write about what you think and hope third grade will be like. What are you most excited about? What are you nervous about? What do you hope to do? And they can draw a picture as well. Then we have this story, which we will read together. This will be one of the things we do together so they know what to do in the future when they have similar stories. At the end, there are like questions about story elements, focusing your attention, and ordering sentences. So that is the packet for next, the end of next week and then through the week after that as well for their center time. We are opening up the box. I'm so excited. That's everything. Do I go? Oh, here we go. I think this will be long enough to plug into my extension cord and have on my desk. I seriously will be using this at least, at least once a week because I prep my reading center workbook and math center workbooks like in a batch. So at least once a week. Oh my god, it's so dark. All right, let's see. Maybe the light doesn't go on. Oh my god. All right. It stapled it, not exactly where I would. I just need to learn how to like place it. Perfect. So I'm getting better at the placement. I finished stapling all of them super fast. I'm really excited, but I forgot I didn't even staple the cover. Because I always do like a reading center workbook and a math center workbook cover. Bye, one's Haley. bye. One's pink, one's blue. Maybe I just won't do it for the first one, or maybe I'll just go back and staple it again. Thank you so much to Afmat for sending me this electric stapler as well as the pencil sharpener and the colored pencil sharpener. I'm so excited. They will be used daily in my classroom. I am honestly obsessed with this already and I'm so excited to use it throughout the year to make my life easier. I'm just going to clean up and head out. I will show you what the classroom is looking like. Just have to shut off all my lights, close up shop. This is what my room is looking like. Pretty much looks exactly the same as the morning. We did a great job of putting everything where I told them to. We really just used our take home folders and our math folders today, that's what we set up. So their math folders for now are in the middle of the group just because their seat pockets didn't come in yet. I don't know if we're getting seat pockets. If not, I'll just have to use like my student number bins that I've used like my first and second year. The only thing is my whiteboard, I 
started using it and erasing and it looks disgusting. Last year it did not do this so I think it's just maybe the new erasers or something. But I'll have to clean that. I'll do that next week because I just don't feel like doing it right now. I'm going to head home now. Today was a really good solid first day. I'm excited for next week. Like I said, we only had one day today and then we don't come back until Tuesday. So I have a nice long weekend ahead of me to recover from this one single day. And I'm pretty much all prepped for next week. So that's good. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.